Ladies and gentlemen, let me be the first to welcome you to Rudy Land's Menagerie of Stars. Sorry about what I said earlier. Today on Rudy Land's Menagerie of Stars, trademark, we have a special actor of the ages. Someone who's appeared in over 150 films. I'm sure some of them were good. Today's guest is Lloyd Bridges. Wait, what? Seriously? Like, how long ago? Oh. Well, uh, never mind. I guess, uh... It turns out that Bo Bridges will be a get. Oh, no. Oh, it's even better. Well, no, it turns out that today's guest will be none other than Jeffrey Bridges. The famous star of stage and screen, known from Timbuktu to Seattle, Washington. The dude himself. Welcome, dude. Do you, is it okay if I call you dude? Or do you prefer I call you, um, you know, Mr. Bridges? How are you today, Mr. Bridges, by the way? Who the fuck are you, man? Please, please, no. Jeffrey, Jeffrey, calm down, please. Who the fuck are you? Why are you following me around? Come on, fuckhead! Mr. Bridges, it's, it's Rudy Land, sir. Like an Irish monk? Rudy Land. We, um, we went to high school together. The who, who, who the fuck are the Knudsons? Fuck it, man. Just stay away from my fucking lady friend. No, yeah, no. I haven't I haven't been by Glenda's in some time. No, the the judge the judge told me the score. I know what's up. The fuck is with this guy? Who is he? Please leave Dieter out of this. It's uh Rudy Land, Jeffrey. Please, can I come in? Can we sit down? Before we record anything, can I just come in and sit down, please? Uh I I don't know, sir. Yeah, but You heard him, let's go now. No, don't do that. Not on the rug, man. Oop, sorry, pardon me. I did not expect your, uh, your driveway to be that muddy. What are you talking about, man? The carrier. What's in the fucking carrier? Marmot. Oh, this is Fizzgig. If I leave him at home, he... He bites neighborhood children. Obviously, you're not a golfer. No, not really. You much of a golfer, Jeffrey? Yeah, but... Now that we got all the pleasantries out of the way, Jeffrey, how's your wife? She doing okay? My, my, my wife? Bunny? Do you see a wedding ring on my finger? Does this place look like I'm fucking married? The toilet seat's up, man! Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. When did you and Susan get a divorce? You've been together since 1977. It's Rudy Land, by the way. Not Bunny. First of all, dude, you don't have an ex. Secondly, this is a fucking show dog with fucking papers. You can't board it, it gets upset. Hey. It's who is this man and what does he mean you don't have an ex? Excuse me, sir, d are you implying something when you say that? I figure it's easy money, you know. It's all pretty harmless. She probably kidnapped herself. Rug Piers did not do this. Look at it. A young trophy wife marries this guy for his money. She figures uh, he isn't giving her enough, you know. She owes money all over town. Was your wife kidnapped? Are you involved? Did you facilitate a sham kidnapping in order to murder your wife? Yeah, but- Who are these rug peers you speak of? No, man, nothing is fucked here. I don't, man, come on. Uh, who are you gonna believe? Those guys are- We dropped off the damn money. The royal we. You know, the editorial, I dropped off the money exactly as per- Look. Man, I've got certain information, alright? Certain things have come to light and, you know- has it ever occurred to you that uh, instead of, uh, you know, running around uh, uh, blaming me, you know, given the nature of all this new shit, you know, it, it, this could be a, a, a lot more uh, 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 complex. I mean, it's not just, it might not be just such a simple, uh, you know? You seem nervous. You keep blathering. And... New what? I have, I, this is the first I'm hearing of any of this. Your new evidence means nothing to me. It's all new evidence, Mr. Bridges. Well, I'll tell you what I'm blathering about. I've got information, man. New shit has come to light. And, and shit, man. Marmot. Hasn't that ever occurred to you, man? Sir? Well, I have to applaud your manners. I, 
I'm not really following. You're saying that marmots kidnapped your wife? Yeah, yeah. <sighs> Why do I only get to interview drug addicts and the mentally unstable? What the fuck is with this guy? Who is he? It's nothing personal. It's just, you know, I'd like to sit down and, and do one of these with somebody who can, you know, converse rationally with me. Fuck are you? Why are you following me around? Jeff, I hope this is the last time I have to say it, but it, it's Rudy Land. We've been talking inside your your giant pipe that's fashioned like a, a rocket ship for about five or ten minutes now, Jeff. I was your lab partner in two different science classes. God damn it, Jeff. We almost got sexually assaulted together. You remember. Coach Costanza. And hey, this is the guy who should compensate me for the fucking rug. His wife goes out and owes money all over town and they pee on my rug? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's mud from your driveway, buddy. If any any urine that was on there, any pee is is from you. And you leave my wife out of this, you son of a bitch. This is between you and me. But please, do go on about the people urinating on your rugs. You know my rights, man. I want a fucking lawyer, man. I want Bill Kunstler, man, or... Or wrong could be. No, no, no. I don't want to cause you any legal trouble, Jeffrey. Just, um... We'll, we're just talking now, alright? Anything you don't like, we can edit out, or... We could just scrap it all, whatever you want. Or... Adam and the Iraq. I hate to be the bearer of bad news, Mr. Bridges, but... All of those men have, have since died, I'm fairly sure. Please, tell me about the, uh... The rug urinations, though. The Chinaman who peed on my rug, I can't go give him a bill! So what the fuck are you talking about? A Chinese man urinated on your rug. Um... Do you know him? Uh... Did he break in? Did you let him in? I... And I'm surprised to say I'd like to hear more. This isn't a guy who built the railroads here. This is a guy... He peed on my rug! Wait, didn't build the railroad? Are you saying the Chinese government, nay, the General Secretary of the Communist Party of China, Xi Jinping, urinated on your rug? He peed on my rug! Unbelievable. According to Jeff Bridges, Xi Jinping is a serial urinator of rugs. Some news that'll truly rock the geopolitical climate of this world. All right, after that, we're gonna, we're gonna need to take a break. I'm feeling a bit hungry. Jeff, you hungry at all? Can I get you or your friend anything? Yeah, sure, white rush for that in the prayer test. Well, let's, uh, after some fact-checking, his story may, um, may not have any evidence, but it surely is compelling. Now, Jeff, moving, plowing ahead here, what, um, what sort of relationship did you have your, with your father? Did, did his acting career sort of steer you into yours? Did you look up to him? Did, did you, um, spend a lot of time with him? He treats objects like women, man. He fucking fascist! A cruel man, then, eh? I'm sorry to hear that. What sort of... What sort of things did he do to you when you were younger? He peed on my rug! He peed on my... Test. Wow, that's... incredibly disturbing. Um... More to the point, why... What is it about you that makes people want to urinate on your rugs. What, um, do you ask for it? Are you, do you want it subconsciously or consciously? What the, what the hell is this? What the fuck is with this guy? Who is he? I just want answers. I just want to help you, okay? Are you still coming to practice on Thursday? No, I just, I just want to handle it by myself from now on. You know, Walter, you're right. There is an unspoken message here. It's fuck you, leave me the fuck alone. Yeah, I'll be at practice. That's r r r r r r r Rudy Land, folks. A 
looks like your mother really was kidnapped after all.